I'm really proud of everything that we've achieved at Haringey Learning Partnership in the last year. I think we have grown and developed as an organisation and I think what that's led to is even better outcomes for our young people than I think any of us ever imagined would be possible within such a short space of time. And I'm incredibly proud of each young person who has attended Haringey Learning Partnership, many of whom have now returned to their mainstream schools, um, or even in some cases moved on to new mainstream schools. And I think last year we had over 60 children and young people who returned from Alternative British Vision in, back into mainstream education and are still in those mainstream schools and are incredibly successful in those schools. And I think that is testament to how Haringey schools work together um, as a family of schools. And we allow opportunities for our young people to go back into schools with the right support um, and hopefully go on to be incredibly successful. I think when I reflect on the last year, you know, our GCSE outcomes for those young people who did stay with us until the end of year 11, we're incredibly positive, the most positive that we have had as an organisation so far. It has been an incredible year for Haringey Learning Partnership. Even today, our students have, have just taken part in a fashion show, um, a group of students who are developing their entrepreneurial skills. We've had students who visited an open studio um, to develop their art GCSE coursework. Um, students been at Jamie's Farm today. Um, and other students who have been taking part in a construction workshop. That's one day at HLP. So I'm very optimistic for what we'll achieve as an organisation in 2023 and the fantastic outcomes that I'm sure we will see for our quite remarkable young people.